free if you want to see an additional 5 minute preview of this next Ultra Vegito episode for free just sign up to my manga newsletter mangaletter.com using the links in the description or pinned comment and simply enter an active email and your name and it will be with you instantly after for free so make sure to check your spam, junk or other folder if you don't see it this is a treat for every one of you who cannot afford the Patreon, so enjoy. But he didn't budge. As with a stunned look, the Archangel would be lost for words with how flat his punch would land, not able to follow through at all. As on closer inspection, not only Lucy's muscular chest would still be left in place, but without as much as a single dent, bruise or scratch to show for the all-powerful Saiyan's attack. Stop playing with me! You're going to pay for what you did! But Goku losing himself would just yell in more anger before. <laughs> Pulling back, he would this time attempt to punch right onto Lucif's ribs anatomically what should be what is one of his weakest points yet nothing would change only a simple flutter of Lucif's long hair backwards <laughs> how strange i'm getting a sense of deja vu here as Lucif looking down at goku's fist with his teeth bared would continue it seems, young Goku, though you have surpassed my little brother, this archangel you speak of is nothing of the sort. A harmless mortal replica, just like everything you Saiyans do. <laughs> huh? There's no way! There's no way this isn't affecting him! Was he really always this strong? As Goku, now for the first time beginning to panic, as sweat would accumulate over his face, would soon begin to realize just what a canyon-sized gap in power had emerged in front of him. Uh, no! No, Goku! As back down on the ground, the long purple-haired Saiyan would just continue to watch on. It's just like in my timeline. Nothing's changed. Me coming here hasn't done a thing. This Lucif is just as strong as before. No, he's even stronger. What have I done? As with his countenance continuing to look as one full of regret and chilling paralysis from fear, the future god killer could do nothing but contemplate and blame himself for how things would be going. And seemingly even worse than in his own timeline, if that was even possible. Let go! But that possibility may have just become a whole lot more possible when in the very next panel, brutally, Lucif would grab the Archangel by the throat as if he were just a helpless child. I can't breathe! Getting worse by the second as the Omni King would then lift Goku up into the air, leaving the Saiyan struggling to talk. But as the sight of his son would come into view, anger on Goku's face would at least allow him to grumble under the crushing weight on his windpipe to say... Why? Why have you got Gohan? Let him go and fight me! I'm the one you want! <laughs> Even using the last of his strength to once again in futility, Strike Lucif, slamming a kick onto his smiling face. But yet again, it would be like one of us striking a brick wall. <sighs> you 
says, when have I ever had interest in you, son, Goku? All you are is a ripped off piece of my main gold, Vegito. But as Lucif would look on at Goku unfazed, he would continue explaining, At least he was my main gold. But now, I found someone even more interesting. You ask why? Well, allow me to explain. This child fought me recently, and instantly, I knew his power was nothing like the rest of you Saiyans. Not mortal in the slightest. Almost as if there was a never-ending potential. Power that had to be from some other realm. My realm to be exact. I did some research into this boy's origin. And past being your son, I soon learned this child's grandfather was known as the Ox Demon King. A line of demons that made their way to the mortal realm eons ago. Just like the Namekians did. To think, after so many generations, one of the progeny would live up to its heritage. But speaking of Namekians, usually such latent demonic power needs another demon for training it. And that is when I discovered, as a child, he trained with none other than the Demon King Piccolo Spawn. <laughs> he even got his potential unlocked by yet another Namekian. Cool, I believe. Long story short, your son is not who you think he is. Huh? Go on! But as Goku, would hear this tidal wave of information. With his simple mind, he would barely be able to comprehend it fast enough to respond in any way. But Lucif, now suddenly pointing to Gohan, would then add, Yes, son Goku, your son, and you will learn now exactly what I mean, as he becomes the vessel, if not for me for an entirely new demon. What? Steady on now. And if you want more, the next video is already up live on my Patreon right now for over 4,500 plus incredible patrons who are getting early access episodes for life as well as actively seeing hidden Ultra Vegito content. And if you want that too, head to my Patreon to see the full next video and see just what insane turn of events happens next in yet another very long episode. So join now and talk to me. Links are in the description and pinned comment.